Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica Moore of Miss Moore Style and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Allure Huda Beauty Box. Hey guys, welcome back. So Today I wanted to do a little unboxing of a subscription box. There are so many subscription boxes out there. Which one do you get? Let me tell you, I have opinions on pretty much all of them. Today I'm going to be doing the Allure Huda Beauty Edition. I've done an unboxing a long time ago. It was like probably one of the first videos I ever did on my channel. I don't recommend watching it. It's not great quality, but if you guys want to see how far I've come, I will link it up in the cards and oh, I'll put it in the description box too. It is cringe, but it that one does give you a good overview of four major subscription boxes. So if you're still kind of thinking about which one you might want to get, that video is still pretty relevant, I think, because those subscription boxes haven't changed too much since that video. Watch it if you dare. If you guys are new here, welcome to my channel. I do a lot of fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel content. I usually focus on things that are budget friendly. So if you are like me and you are balling on a budget, hit that subscribe button because I got you, girl. Make sure to hit that bell so that you get a little notification every time I do a video. Today is Thursday. I usually upload videos on Mondays, but I've been playing around with doing videos twice a week, one on Mondays and one on Thursdays. I can't promise that every Thursday there will be a video. This is something I'm sort of experimenting with, but um, seeing how it goes. There's a lot of content that I wanna share with you guys. So I've been sort of like churning them out a little faster lately. Right, so enough chit chat. You guys ready? Let's do this. First up. Okay, so this little guy will basically give you the information that you need about all the products in your Allure box. This comes in all the Allure boxes, but I'm sure you guys just wanna see what's in here, so let's get to it. First of all, the box itself. Really, really nice. I love an inspirational quote. We've got this like a bag type situation. The Allure boxes usually always come with these bags. I feel like they're trying to do the Ipsy thing which is cute, I guess, but in my experience, these bags do not last. I've tried to reuse them for different purposes and they usually rip. Allure, make better makeup bags. Thank you. All right. Also have this that is was not in the bag, but <laughs> that was a little bit too aggressive. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this. This is the Huda Beauty Liquid Matte Lipstick the shade alluring wow that is so on brand might this be an exclusive i think it is it is huda beauty for allure that's why the name so you get this exclusive color in this box and let's just swatch this shall we i love liquid matte lipsticks because i just feel like they stay on if they're good ones and then you don't have to worry about them so I'm always looking for one that dries down really nice, that doesn't transfer when I'm eating, that doesn't like smear all over my face and then I'm walking around all day looking like a crazy person and also doesn't like transfer to my husband when I kiss him because like that is the number one reason why I wear matte liquid lips because he just will not let me anywhere near him if he sees any sort of sheen on my lips because he knows that means if I touch him, it's coming off on him and he is not about that life. I'm just gonna let this uh, dry a little bit to see how it dries down. But that is the color. I love this color. It's a really pretty like orangey red, which can never get enough red lipstick. Red is like my favorite color to wear. And this one is kind of like a little bit more summery, so really fun color i'm excited to wear this let's get into the bag so there's also some other products in here that are not Huda, like the hangover rx too faced replenishing face primer i have used some of the products from the hangover line and i've loved them so, little sample size so in the uh, allure bag you usually get sample size products <clears throat> Are we done? Okay, great. So this has coconut water and it's probiotic based in probiotic based ingredient and skin revivers. So I'm excited to give this a try. 
I'm always looking for a good primer and I'm kind of low on the primer that I usually wear so next we have Ali it is a Eau de Parfum a little sample right there and it is in vanilla 28 it has vanilla orchid tonka absolute brown sugar amber woods and musk these are the scents that i literally live for so let's take a little test here oh it smells so good my like signature perfume that i usually wear is flower bomb by victor and rolf and this is it just, oh my God, it smells so rich. It smells sweet, but also like sophisticated. And that's like the fine line for more vanilla scents is like you don't want to smell like a cupcake, like straight up. I mean, I kind of do want to smell like a cupcake, but I kind of also want it to smell a little bit more <laughs> on the refined side. So I appreciate perfumes like this that give me that scent that I love without being like too like childish smelling. Okay, next, we have a mask. Tony Molly Intense Care Gold or 24 Karat Gold Snail Hydro Gel Mask. Wow, that is a lot. Appears to be a K Beauty brand based on the Korean on the back side of it. A gold added snail hydro gel mask that helps with elasticity and to vitalize your skin. This gives you moisture, elasticity, nourishment, gold added ingredients such as snail secretion filtrate and ginseng callus extract currently the snail secretion i hate that word filtrate have a structure similar to the structure of your skin um, so it can help to strengthen your skin's barrier and it has fast absorption into your skin which is what you want get it in there it's one sheet mask it seems rather large but i'm excited i always love to have a good sheet mask at night i do these a couple times a week and i always take these when i travel uh, because you, when you travel, your skin just gets so dehydrated from the plane. So I will be adding this to my collection and using it soon. Next, we have the Way. We I, honestly, this is so embarrassing, but am not 100% on how to pronounce this word. It's all vowels. Uh, anyway, this brand, I have a couple of their other products and I really like it. This is their texturizing hairspray. It is, it's like dry shampoo. Blah, blah. Let's try that again like dry shampoo and hairspray had a baby so it gives your hair like a texturized look but also helps hold your style so it's a lightweight hairspray that helps to build volume in your hair so the next time I do beach waves I'm definitely gonna give this a try because I feel like it will give that like bigger more messy look that I always want when I do my beach waves next it looks like we got some lashes I always love a good pair of false eyelashes and i love the shape of these they're very wispy which is what i i always look for when getting falsies this is a godsend because i feel like all of my eyelashes have fallen out lately gotta get those beautiful lashes going back on just to revisit the swatch that i put on my hand i feel like it is dry now but i just want to test like how it yeah it does transfer and it feels like pretty tacky to the touch it doesn't feel like a dry matte so while i love the color the formula is not my favorite but i will live with it and i'll just be aware when i wear that one to not be my normal hot mess all right guys well i hope you enjoyed that little unboxing of the allure july beauty edition box if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give this a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below if you want me to do a review on another subscription box that you're curious about. I am totally open to taking uh, requests for that. So give me a comment down below. Let me know which one you want to see next. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye!